Hey all, I hope you guys are doing well. I wanted to take this time to wish you all a happy Mother's Day and especially to my mom back in South Africa. But I also wanted to make a very, very quick video really to highlight and give a special thanks to single mothers because motherhood as is is very, very difficult. I mean parenthood, but we know mothers uh, the things that they have to do uh, while raising their kids. So for single mothers, there's even an added burden because they literally face the world many times alone. Um, so I wanted to start with my mother because as some of you know, uh, my mother raised a few, um, actually she raised four <laughs> beautiful, strong women. My sister's back home and uh she's also raised me of course and i live here in america but she's also raised a countless other kids um that needed a home and uh she's done a wonderful job doing that and it's been beneficial not only to the kids but to her as well so i wanted to give a special shout out to single mothers out there uh this is not to say of course that you know like uh two parent homes or single fathers don't deserve credit. Everybody who raises a child deserves a credit. But since this is a Mother's Day video, I thought I should highlight um, single mothers. Uh, my mother taught me everything that I am today. Um, as I said, she raised four children without help at all. Uh, we were born in South Africa during apartheid and uh, she lived in Cape Town uh, with no immediate family. Um, and she raised her four girls with grace, hard work, and sheer determination. Um, I cannot thank her enough, and I know there's very little in this world that I can do uh, to show how much I appreciate everything that she did. She taught me the value of sacrifice, the value of hard work, the value of everything that I value today, you know, like staying in school, all those things. Um, without her, I wouldn't be where I am today. I, I recall my mother, uh, as some of you know, she worked uh, as a tea girl. A tea girl in South Africa is someone who makes tea for people who work in offices. So her job at her work was to make tea. Um, and she did that for more than 21 years. That meant that she had to get up really early and be and, and basically try to catch a train and go to her job. And as you know, um, a lot of black people in South Africa, they had to live far from the city center where the jobs were. So that meant that taking uh, waking up super early uh, and literally go um, to your job so you can get there before everyone else gets there. But here's the thing. My mom always made sure, as a little kid, she always made sure that all of us were clothed, were, we had our uniforms on, uh, we ate breakfast before she left the house. That meant for us waking up at 5 a.m. so that we can eat and get dressed before she leaves the house. And she did that religiously um, without ever complaining. And she had no help, no help. When I mean no help, she had no help. And so, uh, and when you're young and uh, you really don't begin to appreciate uh, the sacrifice that, you know, your parents or your mother in this case um, uh, had to make for you. And as I look back in my own life and, uh, and how appreciate I have, uh, appreciative I have been that I have my husband to help me, I think about my mother and all the hard work that she had to go through uh, in raising us. Uh, my mother um, sacrificed a lot, a lot for us as her girls. She would not let anyone uh, harm us. She would not let anyone close to us that could harm us. And um, she taught us the, the values that we took to our adulthood. And I cannot appreciate enough how much she did for us. Um, and uh, so... I don't want to make this video very long. I want to say thank you so much for everything that you did for me. And I also want to, for people to understand that when a lot of times fathers 
work out okay mothers are left to carry it on and they are not you know like it's not their fault and they don't try to lay blame all they do is step up and that's what my mother did and to all the single mothers out there i see you and i truly want to appreciate uh, show you how much i appreciate the sacrifice that you have made in your children's life a lot of you here in america um uh have raised you know like presidents obama's mother uh some of you has raised a lot of the kids who are super successful out there who either play sports and some of you have raised doctors some of you have raised musicians some of you i mean you've done a lot of great things and we should appreciate you not because uh, we feel pity for you, but really understanding the sacrifice that you have to make uh, in order to raise fully functional human beings that become adults. So thank you so much. And I hope all the mothers out there have a wonderful, wonderful uh, thank, um, uh, Mother's Day. And I am going to try and enjoy mine. And to my children, I love you and I appreciate you. And thank you for making me a mom. Thank you. Bye.